Hello, welcome back. Uh, finally, Apple released iOS 18.2.1 to the public, which means that all of you should be able to update to the new version. And for me, the size is about uh, 500 megabytes. Apple didn't mention any specifically, it just said this update provided important bug fixes and is recommended for all users. Uh, for me, the iPhone 16 Pro Max, I already updated to 18.2.1. But what I want to recommend after you update to the new version, you need to go into setting, uh, go into general and about. And if you see like any carry update, you should be able to click on update on it. But for me, I already done it. So after update to the new version here, there is no new option, new button. Uh, but for the performance, it, uh, it has been great for me. So after you update to 18.2.1, uh, from the App Store, you need to update all of your app to the new version. So if there is uh, any update available, it should be able to update it to make sure that it will great on the new version that you already update. Now, thanks for watching. I hope this video helped you. Then we'll see you guys in the next one.